what do we mean when we talk about quantum? The big news about quantum is that in the first time in millennia, we invent a new way of computing. Quantum technology is something that's rapidly developing and it will have a big impact on the world. Our work's very necessary if you're going to use quantum computing to actually work on real life uh, problems. To be able to actually share the, what the quantum capability will allow in the future, we absolutely need to open it up. There will be problems we can solve with quantum that will be totally intractable classically. In 2050, three quarters of the world's population will live in urban centres. So we're already trying to anticipate what's happening uh, in, in the world as we know and how the, the, there'll be a need to adapt to uh, uh, the way we live. At this time, quantum computers will no longer be isolated to the lab. Governments, private companies, institutions of learning will all be harnessing this technology. We see this already having a huge impact on aeronautics and much more. We'd very much appreciate if governments and particularly local authorities would look uh, objectively to the future to spare some time to look at innovation. It is a geopolitical topic where many public and private actors are already investing. There's a huge gap between people who know the theory of quantum computing and people with the application problem. And we started to bridge that. Looking at quantum computing through a diplomatic lens, we see that there are gaps. Some players cannot afford to take part in the development or use of quantum computers. Also, the application in wider societal and environmental challenges has not been fully explored. We believe everyone should have the right to benefit from this science and its potential should be harnessed to progress the UN Sustainable Development Goals. One of the core ideas that came from the task force was an open quantum institute, an inclusive, uh, collaborative effort around developing the technology will ensure that you know, the future of these technologies will benefit the entire human race and not just certain companies or countries. With an Open Quantum Institute, or OQI, JESTA and its community propose to enable a space where quantum computing is made accessible and understandable to all. Bringing these actors together to make a baseline for use cases around SDGs is going to be at the core of what the uh, Open Quantum Institute will bring. This is fundamental to our work, bringing science and diplomacy together to allow room for discourse and multilateral coordination. Brokering this conversation in the early stages of any new technology will allow everyone to have the tools that impact people, society and the planet. The Open Quantum Institute is well placed in Geneva and, and in Switzerland with different actors from the international governance world. The Open Quantum Institute will work with a global networks of partners who focus on universal challenges and the UN Sustainable Development Goals who help define and prepare real-world use cases for quantum computing applications. Quantum is a complex technology. Uh, it's something that when you just say quantum, a lot of people run away because it's like, I'm not a physicist, I don't know anything about quantum. We need the best and brightest people on the planet to help us. We are calling to technology providers and developers to express their interest in tackling the SDG use cases the OQI will be providing. We also need governments to actively help shape the multilateral relevance of the Open Quantum Institute. We want the OQI not to just be an idea on paper, but a real center where you can all come and benefit from it. This is a brand new approach and we want you to join the discourse and share your ideas and help us test it. Together, we can use the future to build the present.